Hi everybody, this is Char from Charlie's Angel Tarot and this is your reading for the 4th till the 10th of May. And I'm back to my old mouse because the other one is not that reliable anymore. So um, I'm using only three cards and uh, also the tarot deck and I'm using the uh, Wild Unknown Tarot. Okay, that's the one and I'm also doing the crystal ball and this reading is for you Capricorn so let's have a look I've cleaned the crystal before I started and I also put the cards out I see a triangle I see a triangle for you and there might be a triangular situation Okay, might be something new coming in, like work, home and a new person that's coming in and you're trying to balance everything. You're trying to spread yourself too thin. I'm not seeing a third person in a relationship, not that at all. It's just you've got too much on your plate. You've got, you've got three things on the go and you are spreading yourself too thin. Okay. I also see an extension of something, an extension, okay? So there will be an extension. There's something shooting out like a rock out of yeah, something shooting out in the middle, out of a platform. I know you can't see it, but I hope you can trust me because that's what I'm seeing. I also see a lot of paths crossing each other. So it's like a confusing time that perhaps it's a confusing time for you. Okay. Yes, uh, uh, there's things, it's like I see a path but there's all kinds of boulders or rocks on that path and the path is going in an is in a bend shaped going like this it's not straightforward it's you know i think you've got to sort out some information find out more information do more research and i also see a heart so it could be about love trying to balance love work and home life perhaps grandparents or parents in law that um, are living in with you at this moment but I think you're trying to sort out, perhaps trying to move them once this uh, situation is passed and that they live closer to you so that you can take better care. Something like that is coming up. Now I'm going to shake the cards and I'm going to s see whether that resonates with the cards. Okay, that could be a three coming out or uh, a third, the house, a third, a Gemini, that's the third house, that could be it, that would be the king of swords, so let's have a look what the cards are saying, okay, this one has fallen out, that's too many, okay, I'll shake them like this, the backs of them are just like snake skin, I think it's awesome. Okay, I'm taking the bottom and we've got the Emperor and the Emperor also represents Aries. I'm taking one from the top and it's the Ace of Wands. Okay, so Aries, Wands, that's all the fire signs and I'm taking one from the middle and that's the High Priestess. Right, and I'll take one from here and that is the tree the tower unexpected and wow look at this underneath the deck the three of wands i said three okay let's go into this and see what it means my darling okay um let's have a look right sorry i'm still cooking at the moment okay the first um card is the Emperor. The Emperor. I think it's a beautiful card. 
and because it's a tree uh, I have to think back to um, the Linamon and that's the health card so you see how cards can uh, give you different messages and I said I saw a triangle so a triangle a tree a triangle it's coming out it's crazy how it works but it does and I trust it so you might be meeting an Emperor which is an Aries and an Emperor is a fa could be a father figure that gives you advice or a professional person uh, you might seek a professional person for advice this could be a bookkeeper a lawyer uh, a medical professional uh, because I keep on getting health so or somebody else's health something so you might be seeking advice or seeking advice on um, for, for example if you take care or in-laws or grandparents or parents then you might seek advice on how to get this all done Wow amazing okay um, then we have the ace of wands that means action okay this action means work or a new project this could also be something creative you might do something creative this could also be passion with an air sign so that's Aries Leo or Sagittarius Capricorn okay and then we have at the end of the week Friday the High Priestess and you this is number two and it is also moon card it's she represents the moon and it's like a crystal ball here or you can take it as an atlas whatever resonates with you an atlas means a world ball so you might have the world in your hands the world is your oyster or you might have a crystal ball and you're listening or trying to see into the crystal ball and see what the future holds for you or how to do something which road to take like I've just done you can see a lot in the crystal ball okay so balance perhaps you've got number two she is a lady she um, she holds the uh, Torah or the book of wisdom she doesn't tell everybody her what she knows the answers because she knows the answers to everything it could be a Pisces okay because she represents the moon and also the moon goddess so it could be a Pisces that might advise you or help you um, listen to your intuition and your psychic psychic abilities might be heightened at the moment or you might be more sensitive but listen to your gut feeling it is never wrong and then you've got the tower and the tower means an uh, unexpected moment of the tower is falling an unexpected change something was not built on proper foundations one door closes 20 will open remember that so this might be all of a sudden that you might have to take care of a situation and uh, it could be a third party like parents or somebody else you're taking care of and you need to get into action uh, to help them with their health issues or situations you might have to take them to the doctor uh, the emperor you might have to take them to the doctor because they're elderly and it's unexpected right so um, something was not built on proper foundations my darling don't be scared of it take it as an adventure and that you know you uh, you couldn't make the decision or the choice in the past so the divine and the angels made it for you the change is here right now and at the bottom of the deck we've got the three of ones now I said there was a triangle there was uh, a path a, uh, that was going zigzag well that is unexpected a zigzag can also mean that uh, the road is winding and turning and that you couldn't make decisions because you're up and down perhaps could that could be it as well and the decision is made for you but you had plans and like I said this could be an atlas or a crystal ball in the uh, traditional tarot there's somebody standing there uh, with uh, 
three uh, three wands and in some decks it's, he's also got an atlas in his hands so he's got the world in his hands his plans are coming to fruition he sees the boats coming in and that is at the weekend now the first card that you have from the uh, healing angels deck I think it is I'll get the box it is Dutch yes the healing uh, strength of the angels okay and it is Dutch so I have to translate it for you it is health Wow so you must either take better care of your health or you must be taking care of somebody else's health I think you might be stressed so take care of your health and there might be somebody else that needs help your helping hand spiritual vision the, uh, the high priestess missing piece of the puzzle like I said you need to do more research okay that's what I said in the crystal ball so the crystal balls coming um, together with the cards that's good news Archangel Michael hands you an energetic key the sacred key activates the window of your soul effectively heightening your spiritual vision to reveal a vital piece of missing information that's the high priestess so Archangel Michael is giving you the key know that the divine and the angels are with you he will teach you and he will open up your throat chakra and your lungs and so and he's giving you a key so you can say what you have to say use your wisdom because he stands for the wisdom and also justice clarity so you get clarity do some more research boom 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 spiritual vision listen to your intuitiveness your psyche might be heightened and the angel feather that you have is the royal blue angel feather the chosen path found the angels the angels would like to reassure you that you have definitely found your chosen path congratulations you are on track so the angels and the divine have given you a sudden change the royal blue angel feather is presented to you as a symbol of life purpose the angels know that the people who ask have I found my life purpose or am I on the right path are actually those who are following the divine guidance the angels applaud your good judgment and ask that you stay confident the path you have chosen will bring you stability and success now the crystals that you can wear to enhance this is lapis lazuli and kyanite okay and it's Archangel Samuel and Michael and Raphael so like I said uh, Michael will open your throat chakra and your lungs and Samuel is the uh, angel of the heart with Haniel but it is only Shaniel um, that is there so she will open your heart to love and Raphael he will open your third eye your spiritual being the high priestess okay there you go I don't hide, hide anything I'm transparent hopefully enough if you've got any questions then let me know in the live series on Monday Wednesday or Friday I go live and give out free cards and I can answer questions after a donation okay have a look if the cards resonate with you okay my Capricorn I love you loads and I hope you've enjoyed this reading and I hope to see you in the life please share this video with family and friends uh, stay safe and stay healthy and be blessed Thank you for coming to the, and watching the video. Love you all. Take care.